Congrelate lets you see and sort information about your members of Congress and their districts. We've taken a bunch of data about members of Congress and put it all in one place so that you can see it, sort it, and see how they relate. Just want to see quickly who got the most money from tobacco companies in 2008? Thanks to Congrelate and OpenSecrets.org, you can do just that. What about figuring out which members of Congress represent the most Hispanics? We parsed the last census information and put it into Congrelate so that you can do that too. Congrelate can help you answer some of the more interesting questions too, like which women voted against the Lilly Ledbetter Fair Pay Act? Hmm, I wonder what party these people are in. Congrelate does committees too. For instance, if you just want to know the Democratic members of the Ways and Means Committees, you just add committee information, click on Ways and Means, and then sort by party. But what if you wanted to see who is on both the Ways and Means and the Oversight and Government Reform Committee? You can use the handy filter bar to easily figure that out. Looks like it's Van Hollen and Danny Davis. I wonder if they have any top contributors in common too. Looks that way, health professionals. Congrelate can help you figure out what members have in common with each other too. Here's John Murtha. He gets money from defense contractors, computers and internet, and lobbyists. I wonder who else does. Let's type defense and lobbyists into the filter bar and see who comes up. Interesting. Three members of Congress have this kind of profile. I wonder what committees they're on. How about that? They're all on appropriation. Congrelate makes it easy for you to take the data with you. You can link to it easily with the permalink button here or take the data with you via CSV. For developers, Congrelate is also a platform for you to build off of and to contribute to. It is an open source software project that you can get off of GitHub here. Congrelate is a Sinatra application built in Ruby that has modular access to the data sources so that it can mash up together. That means that you, the developer, can fork the project, add your own data sources, and contribute them back to the public. If you're interested in, say, election victory margins and don't see them in Congrelate, write a parser that gets the data and contribute it back to the project. We'll spot check that data and make sure that it's accurate and then add it back in. Congrelate also has a simple JSON export format. Any query that's done in Congrelate will also be exported in JSON. The JSON URL is a GET URL too, so it should be fairly self-explanatory on how to get the data out of Congrelate this way. So thanks for checking out Congrelate. We're really excited to have this experimental tool and platform out for giving people access to our data and making it easy for developers to start contributing their own data sources. Hopefully for Congrelate, this is just the beginning. Please make sure to let us know how you like it and how we can make it even better for you.